Howdy y'all and welcome to the Human Horror Channel. We're going to do a map review. Obviously, you already know that because it's in the it's in the title of this video when you clicked on it. We're also doing it on Evergreen Valley, which you already know as well. But so I'm not going to read the description because I'm going to put that down below. So if you would like to read what the uh, map creator Zero Oito I guess that's how you spell it. O-I-T-O something. Zero Oito. Um, he's the guy that made the map. A uh, guy or girl. Whichever one it is. And it says though. The map contains 39 new products. A train. Various points of sale. Points of sale to sell everything. Point of sale to sell everything. Which is a mod. You have to have that. Of course if you're on PC it'll just go ahead and download all that. I don't know how it works on console. I assume it probably do the same thing. But 41 purchasable purchasable plots of land 31 fields collectibles and more so it sounds like he's got it set it up to be ooh, look at that really exciting so it also one of the mods you have to have is the lizard circular pivot irrigation which I'm assuming might already be set up on these fields it kind of looks like it is maybe where you go over there and actually we can go you know, like right this, you know, enter vehicle right there. Look at that, man. You already own that field? You do. It's actually where you start out at. That's that's the land you own anyway. You start out next to this vehicle over here. Which, that's a pretty fancy looking truck. So you already start with a big old 18 wheeler with a loader on the, a wheel loader on the back. And a nice looking Massey Ferguson tractor. And then you got this and this and... You have another wheel loader? I guess you, maybe this is just the shop's wheel loader. I don't know. It looks like it's in the shop. I guess maybe it needs to be worked on. And a New Holland Combine. Only half of this is planted? That's very strange. Hmm. Huh. It's not in the Combine. Is it in our stuff? It is. Look at that. He's already harvested half the field. That's kind of neat. Ooh. I like that. Is that one of the mods required? Lizard F350. It sure is. I'm probably going to use that now. That's a nice looking truck. Right there, man. Ooh. Oh, this this is our map right here. <laughs> this is. A, can we get the tractor out? We can. It also requires you to have... Wait a minute. I was going to say that looks just like the setup on... Uh, sort of the setup on the, the stock map. I can't remember what it's called. But anyway. Let's go... So there's that and that. And then, okay, so we were there. Now we have a John Deere 7810, which you also start with. And then, of course, you own one of these. That's kind of neat. I don't know how one of them's work, but... Uh, are we at the farm? We are not at the farm. We're at the store. Let's get to the farm. I think that was at the farm, wasn't it? It was. Okay. The truck was at the farm, too, but I'm... I'm like jumping around, man. I'm jumping around. So we also start with a header trailer. A fertilizer. Everything looks dirty. Let's see. Does he already have everything like racked up where it's got a whole bunch of hours and stuff on it? Which which one tab is that one? This one. Um, it looks like, yeah, some of the stuff has quite a few hours on it. 4,700, 4,700, 2,500. Ooh, it looks like some of these need service already. That's, that's pretty cool. I mean, there's already stuff you need to be spending money on. And this is... I went in as a new farmer. Just I like to see where the way the map, had, you know, the map creator sets it up, and but you can play it however you want. Sometimes on some mod maps you can go in as, you know, land manager or start at the very hardest part on the hard difficulty, and all this stuff will still be here. But most of the time it's not. And this is also one of the mods you have to download something about American houses or something like that. Let me see over here, American farmhouse mod. So this is very fancy looking. This this is a very very fancy looking farm. Oh, we've got a piano. All right. Nice little bedroom. Oh, there's a video game right there. Maybe they're playing farming simulator. Ah, oh, this is pretty cool. I guess that's probably wardrobe and where's the sleep trigger? That wasn't the sleep trigger, was it? I guess it could be. It's next to the bed. It is a sleep trigger. Maybe the wardrobe trigger somewhere else. Anyway, let's jump in our pickup truck and we'll drive around the map because it's probably going to be the fastest vehicle. Oh, look at that. There's a big old grain trailer in there. I didn't check that out. 
Look at me missing stuff. Okay, so your silo's there, but you have a... I'm guessing this is a barn silo? Maybe this is for storing hay? Let's see what it is. This will tell us right here. We go like that, click on that. Farm barn. Okay. I'm guessing it actually stores stuff. But then you have this hopper trailer. There's just loads of stuff, man. Let's see what do we got in here. Uh, so miscellaneous, that's the bed of the truck. Header trailer, low loaders, wheel loaders, fertilizer spreaders, sprayers, rollers, seeders, disc arrows, headers, trailers, something, something. Loads of stuff. All right. We are, we are, we are just loaded, loaded, loaded with stuff. We start with a hundred thousand dollars and about, you know, every vehicle you could probably need for a while. But, uh, let's look around the map a little bit. If we can figure out how to get out of, why is my brakes not working? Apparently the brakes on my truck need to be adjusted, I guess. Uh, yeah, we need to go this way. Need to open the gate here. We'll zoom out so we can get a good old look at it. I like the circles, though. I mean, he's definitely set it up to where, like, you know, okay, so we don't, that's the one we own. We don't own that one, but he's definitely got it set up to where you can go ahead and put the irrigation system on it. So we're here. We're just going to go, I guess, turn left and go down and see what all that is. He's definitely got loads of stuff on the map. It is pretty, looks like it's pretty well set up. It's a li little bit flat for my liking, but, you know, that's good for farmland. I guess there's some hills and stuff. Expand your fleet. Let's see what all we got over here. It'll tell us here. So, not that. Concrete factory. Rent train. Metal factory. Bale and pallet storage. Another rent train. That's a grain silo for the train. So, we got recycling center. Lizard Logistics, Hotel Central, Hotel Room, what is that? I'd be interested, what is that? I guess maybe you can just sleep up, oh, that's kind of clever. I wonder if it costs you money. Hmm, does it? No, it doesn't, okay, so it's just a sleep trigger at a hotel. That's kind of, that's kind of fancy, I've not seen that before. Uh, liquid Fertilizer and Herbicide, Seeds Fertilizer Lime. Oil extraction. What do we got up here? Huh. Buy production point. I buy oil extraction for $480,000. Ooh, there we go. There's a mine. Huh. Here we go. Boy, this would get you something to do, wouldn't it? putting in a mine. It doesn't look like you can actually go in the mine, but uh, there is a mine down here. I guess you could sit here and mine rocks out or something. If you buy the production point for $635,000. I guess while we're at it, how much does a field cost? So we own that one. What does two cost? Two ninety nine. That's not too bad. I wonder if it comes with Let's just do this right quick. Wonder if it comes with an irrigation system. I bet it doesn't. It's probably not something that it would would come with. But I'm gonna check it anyway. Why not? It does not come with one. Oh well. I didn't know if it maybe had it set up. I don't know. A marble mine. Let's visit the marble mine. Oh, that's cool looking. running already? Is there just a sound effect? It is. The sound effect's just coming out of that. Oh, it's coming out of this loader, too. That's kind of neat. Put a little bit of, little bit of audio death into it. Oh, this thing's running, too. Okay. Alright, man. So, mining. I don't know if I ever played on a map with mining, but, you know, 
I guess we could do it. I mean, I guess if I had some people say, hey, you know, I'd be interested in watching a series on this map if you wanted to do it, then I, I'd, I'd give it a shot. I wonder what that is. There's nothing over there telling me what it is. Oh, it's a coal mine. So, like, the whole north half of the map is nothing but a mining community, like, a mining thing. you got three different mines you can buy into. So, loads of stuff to do. I mean, if you, I guess, probably if you wanted to just never, you know, farm at all, you could just, or if you wanted to do both, you know. But if you never wanted to farm, you could just be a miner. Maybe we could turn all that into a giant forest down there in the croplands. That's kind of neat. I like that. Let's see, what else do we got? Grain mill, bale and pallet storage, grain elevator. Just loads of stuff, man. Let's just do a little little bit more driving around. Um, let's put up this. We can kind of see what we're doing here. A little bit. We'll zoom out so everybody can get get some views of the place. It's cool looking though. Let me just, yeah, we'll follow the road around. Let me put that down so everybody can just, oh crap. A little bit slippery right here. Yeah, I mean, you could, you could build like a giant business, a giant farm business on this place. Oh, going a little fast for that turn, I guess. Maybe we'll just do like a whole lap around the map and check it out. Oh, the road, the road does not go across there. Choo choo, chugga 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 chugga. It's a diesel. I mean, that's close enough, right? Oh, there's a highway. That was a semi on the highway. I don't know if I've ever. Oh, there's sound effects over there too. Where are we at here? Does this gate come up if I just drive toward it? It does. Cool beans. What is this place? They'll already know. Probably. Oil extraction. Already looked at that, I think. We are just we are just there there's a lot to see here. Probably should have went down that highway. It like goes right well there's that truck. Guess we could take that truck around. We just do that and that, and then we can take this truck around. Which way do we need to go here? So we need to go to the left, I guess. This is pretty, I mean, you do start with a lot, but I guess if you started with this much stuff, you could definitely, like, build up pretty quick. I mean, you could get a lot of stuff going pretty fast, just like this. I'm guessing the loaders, though, are for, you know, if you want to do a lot of mining or anything like that. Looks like the town's being worked on a little bit. A little bit of construction renovation going on back there. A nice-looking little community going on. Guessing that's the that's a fair dairy or something like that. It's probably where you sell your milk at. And then this this here be the entrance to our farm. Our steering wheel's funny. That's why I'm sliding around so much. I've got it set my my rotation turned down. All right. I don't guess there's anything else we really... What is this over here? What are all the circles? Oh, it's a legit grain elevator. I'll tell you what we can do. Uh, where'd it go? I missed it. There it is. Oh. Saved it. I don't need to save it. Let's toggle the HUD. And then... 
There we go. That's how you look at a map. Yeah, that's like a legit looking grain elevator right there. That, that's how they look in the big crop states right there. They got this giant silos. They actually have big old big old bunkers there too usually, but this that's usually temporary. Oh, there's even a one that's a uh, trailer's getting filled with grain down there. That's kind of neat. And then some combines sitting out. I mean, he's he's definitely added a lot of detail. A lot of oh, and that's a that's a nice big train. One, two, three grain cars, a load like a a timber car, and then two flatbeds for pallets and stuff. Got some coal action going on, I think. That's a nice big river. Is it actual water? Let's check that out. That's kind of important. Uh, I don't think it is, but let's get out of get out of flight mode right quick and see if it's actually water. It is actually water. Oh, that's that. I like that. That that's kind of neat. And when I say actual water, that means you can actually fill a trailer out of it. It's not just you know looks like water, like a, a water plane or whatever. Yeah, I like it. I like it. Tell you what, man. If you watch my channel, I guess we could always switch from American Falls over to here. If everybody thinks this would be more interesting. So if you're watching right now, like the video. Like it and leave me a comment. And if I get, like, I don't know. If I got a few comments saying that I should switch from American Falls to here. I, I'd, I'd be willing to do that. This is a big old crop area. I'd probably sell all my stuff over there and move over here. Or something like that or make sure I transfer all the same equipment but you know whatever that's besides the point this is just a map you know a map review and tour and stuff like that but I think that's gonna be it guys and I I, I think I looked at just about everything I'd want to see but hopefully y'all enjoyed it and uh, if you did you know leave me a like and a comment down below and I guess if you really want to you can subscribe and we'll hang out you can come see me again We'll just end with sitting on the top of the water tower. You know, pretty cool, man. Oh, airplane. <laughs>